He's tuned up a lot of nice ball games. Beltre loops one to right. That is in for a base hit. Two around third. Here comes the throw from Arcia. It is offline, and now Beltre is caught in a rundown. The ball gets away. There's nobody at second except for Beltre. Botching up a rundown is about as badly as you can botch up the rundown right there. Adrian is counting on the ball going all the way through, which it did, and having an opportunity to get to second base. That didn't happen. But you see the low throw to first base and nobody getting over to cover second base, so the Rangers end up with a man still in scoring position. Swing and a miss. There goes the runner. Torrey puts on the brakes. Now he's going to get caught in a rundown. Now running back toward first base, Torrey trying to make some defensive back moves, and he's finally out. He must have thought he was Torrey Jr. right there. Oh, now they're going to give him second base. We're calling interference here? Wow. How about that? <laughs> oh, the White Sox apparently botched that one up. There's a lot left in this game here, but a five-run lead. Gosh, that's close to a blowout for the Royals. Yeah, the fifth inning has been, oh, they've got... Kane picked off, and here comes Gordon, and he will score. Save! And Kane is safe as well. So the Royals pull off the double steal. And then Lorenzo Kane threw him a, a nice little head fake. Look at him, he's going back now. He tricked the middle infielders here. Got around him. Quick slide. Oh, oh and look at Hill yeah. lunging for him. Yeah, and see, Hill couldn't tag him. And again, that is number one in MLB. And now they have Hamilton in a rundown. And he's safe. He was able to get underneath the tag. That was a poorly executed rundown play by the duo of Rizzo and Addison Russell. Each row, little dribbler, Espinoza. And he's not going to get him. Stanton took too big a turn. It's coming home and is caught between home and third. And Stanton dies and he gets back. Ramos never threw it to Escobar. And somehow Stanton survives. Infield in with a full count. And right to the shortstop on contact. Hayward was headed home. He's in a rundown. And he avoided the tag, and all hands are safe. How in the world did Hayward keep himself in the baseline and stay safe? He's waving that he's okay. He got a right-handed thrower, of course, with the gloves on the grass, the infield side. Couldn't reach across his body. He wasn't that far out of the line. In fact, he wasn't even on the grass. Just jackknifed out of the way. Great move. Matt Kemp has stolen seven. And on that pickoff play, the tag is never made, and Kemp is in there. Matt's pretty fortunate, a sheepish grin on his face. He looked back at Davy Lopes. And the Brewers trying to converge on him. And they gave him an opening. As soon as Reynolds had the ball, he holds the ball, but he doesn't do much of a fake on the pickoff throw. And by the time he gives it to Segura, Mark Reynolds had run him by Segura. Back toward the middle. Gomez has it. And he has Sherholtz caught between third and home. Two. Nina running him down. Throws it high. And and Sherholtz is safe at the plate. Hey, give Sherholtz credit. I mean, he put on the afterburners and he just pulled away from Nina, who waited too long to get rid of that baseball. And now Harrison will pop the train second and third. And the heel will run right at him. Harrison will try and stay in a rundown long enough to get Polanco there. Safe. He's still in the rundown. And he is still safe. Unbelievable. That is impossible. He could not possibly have done that. He got caught. At the very least, Harrison stays at the rundown long enough to get Polanco. And yet, 
Does it go out of the baseline there? I don't think there's any way they overrule this. There goes Harrison. Good jump, too. Throw down. And Harrison overslid. And now he gets himself into a rundown. And Josh is pretty good at these. Yeah, we've seen this before. And he gets past Rosario. Oh, He's unbelievable. safe. He did it again. And Nobody he, at the plate. He almost broke. And he almost could have scored. He does it again. It's incredible. Absolutely wild base running for Josh Harrison.